a quick haul. We are so hungry, so we're gonna do this. Okay, so this is all two weeks worth of groceries. I've got a bunch of different, uh, like menu, uh, I'm not- Recipes. Able to, I've got recipes for the next couple of weeks. Thank you. Danielle's talking for me today. So I grabbed some chickpeas. Um, I will soak those, I'll cook those in the Instant Pot. Um, and so that can be multiple meals right there because you know, I can separate that. Um, we've got our mini chocolate chips that we use for um, like almond flour cookies. I use it in like my oatmeal. Um, and so then um, tuna fish. I think I've mentioned this before, but like, are we the only ones that like will eat tuna fish even though it's disgusting? Like, let me know in the comments. Do you think it's disgusting? One, and two, <laughs> Do you even eat it even though it's disgusting? Okay, um, we've got some bananas. Um, I'm just gonna put these away right now because they're in the way. Um, and then so here I've got a cucumber for a recipe that I'm gonna make. Uh, we've got apples. Sometimes like um, Danielle will eat apples and almond butter, but also sometimes um, I make applesauce. I got some Kroger brand Idaho potatoes. I don't typically buy Idaho potatoes, um, but I was just looking at potatoes because I think I've said it before too, is we used to buy um, uh, the Simple Truth organic potatoes, but they started going bad so quickly and now they don't even sell them. So we've been buying russet, but these just look fresh today and I grabbed them and realized they were Idaho potatoes. Um, some bell peppers for some recipes. Got some onions that will go with multiple things because that will last, I don't know, five, five six, seven meals. Um, I've got some uh, red potatoes that are gonna be for a couple of recipes. Um, our breakfast bars, I've mentioned before that these are really good like sugar upper for Danielle when she wakes up in the morning. Um, I went ahead and just got a small thing of sour cream at Kroger because at our Walmart, they always have their like cooler section go out and so real quick i'll show you so um we got like one of the big sour creams the other day and it was almost like cottage cheese it was so nasty but also these are one of the go-to snacks for danielle and at our walmart these are kind of like in the same cooler area and you can buy these in a box which is like about two dollars cheaper than buying it at Kroger like individually because Kroger doesn't sell the boxes but the boxes keep they're soaked from like the condensation leaking and then then they were tasting funny so we had to take them back and we just got individuals but luckily there was a digital coupon for these so it all worked out so those are Danielle snacks um okay so then also I stocked up on a ton of spices and seasonings and things that were out of so I've got uh turmeric, I've got cumin, basil, oregano, and dill. I didn't realize how expensive dill was. I haven't bought it for a long time, but I have a couple of recipes I'm going to use it in. Um, so got it. Um, syrup for our homemade pancakes, relish for our nasty tuna fish, um, but I also do add it to a chicken salad sometimes. Minced onion, multiple recipes that's going with this week. I've got my milk that I drink this. Danielle drinks almond milk, which they were out of today. I got the big thing of orange juice this time just because we use it in smoothies like crazy. So um, yeah, and then um, Kroger now sells the big bags of pineapple chunks because it's typically, it was usually just these little guys and we'd go through them so fast. So um, we haven't been using as many blueberries. So I just got a small bag of that for pancakes. Um, so pineapple chunks mango um always need baking soda i use it when i make my pancake mix i also use it for vacuuming um got some bread just for like if danielle wants any sort of a sandwich or something um tomato sauce for multiple things our tortilla chips that we really like and then i just needed my own little snack so i really like these little quinoa things um and that is it i think um so yeah so this is two weeks worth of groceries um, last month we tried to do, um, every two weeks, we got a little behind on our budget. I think we went about 40, $50 over, um, for the whole month, but yeah, so we'll see. So, um, if you guessed 
how much this all was. Um, we had so many digital coupons. A lot of the stuff was on sale. Um, and we saved $23.15 and the total was $116. So we are off to a good start for our monthly budget. So if you'd like to see some of these recipes, let me know. I did do one recipe already. Um, I've got so many recipes that I can show you if you wanna see, um, show you just like, you know, nice, yummy, healthy, good, cheap meals. Um, and so, yeah, just let me know in the comments. I can do plenty of recipes that are a good 10 minutes, maybe 15 minutes, just zip, zam, zoom, in the air fryer, in the Instant Pot, all of it. So just let me know in the comments. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you next time. Bye.